Yo, 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 Benji Debs TV here. Don't forget to leave a comment and subscribe so you never ever miss a video. <laughs> What are you doing? Uh, drawing? You're supposed to rest. Henry, your hand. It's fine, Bendy. Don't worry. Mm. What? Bendy, don't give me that face. Mm. Come on. Ah, uh, go rest! You can draw after you rest, Henry. A few moments later. Papa Drew? What is it, Bendy? Henry's overworking again. Wait. Excuse? Henry, rest! No, I'm so sorry, Joey! Please, I'll go back to the bed as soon as I'm finished with this one piece! Just please! No! Joey, no, please let me work! Let me please finish that piece! No. Sammy! Sammy, I know you're there! Help me! Happen, but I don't really care. I'm gonna get the fuck up out of here. This shit, I'm out. Human, don't you know how to greet a new pal? We all know the story of the pacifist's merciful heart, how they stood victorious against crushing foes, and how they built bonds in particular ways. We all know that story. This story, however, was altered. This pacifist never gained any love. The sinister foe could not be defeated. Instead, the pacifist was killed over and over and over. The story as we know it could not progress. So instead, someone changed it. I can't beat him, Sans. I simply can't. You're absolutely sure you can't beat him? Yes. Welp, I guess there's no other way then. Are you going to help me fight him? Better yet, kid. I'm going to kill you. What are you doing? Why are you- <gasps> Listen closely, kid. I need to kill you, but when you die, I'll open a portal and I'm gonna throw you in it, just before your soul shatters. I'll try to send you back to the place you came from, from before you fell down here into the underground. When you get there, you must reset again, but this time, kid, don't come down here before you gained, gained more, more love. love. Sand. Do you have any idea what you're asking? I... Stop. Don't even bother, Sans. It won't work. I've seen it all before. You kill me now, send me back to the beginning where I reset. I keep my promise and several years later, I return to the underground with more blood in my hands than ever before. And when you recognize me, you greet me like a friend. Like I'm some kind of hero. Thank you, kid. But once again, I've become nothing but a murderer. A dirty human killer. I'm so fucking sorry for all of this. And it wouldn't change the outcome either. Because as my love grew strong, I had lost hope. And then we end up back here in this hall, feeling sorry for ourselves. How come I have no memories of this happening? I remember all the resets. The resets, perhaps. But do you know any of the other timelines? I thought not. Sans, to be honest, I do know how Flowey can be defeated. I saw it in other timelines, that is, alternate universes to our own. But... 
but I also know what happens afterwards. No matter how many times we are freed, eventually, there's a reset. Just as you are adjusting to your new life on the surface, you wake up in Snowden again. And there is nothing I can do to prevent it from happening. Well, at least not while they are here. Kara. Whenever I will leave the underground, Kara goes with you. There must be a way to prevent Kara from resetting. Kid? Sansai, I think I just figured it out. You- Sans, would you trust me? Would I- Please, Sans, would you please trust me with one last reset? No questions asked. Please, I know it will work this time. Alright, kiddo. But this will be your last freebie you get from me. The final reset. Don't waste it. Thank you. So as I was saying about the picnic Minnie had planned for tomorrow. Oh look, Oswald, a new face. Huh? Hi there, pal. My name's Mickey Mouse, and this is my brother, Oswald the Lucky Rabbit. Who are you? Oh my, I know who you are, right? It's a pleasure. My name's Ben. Whoa! Oh gosh! Are you? Uh, I'm fine. It's just ink overdose. Uh, give me a second. Uh, there. Is it any better? Uh, yeah. I'm sorry you had to see that. Don't apologize. Most importantly, are you alright? Yeah. You said it was ink overdose? I know that happens to characters who don't get drawn much, but aren't you a part of a company as well? I am. But that doesn't mean I'm as liked as the both of you. W well, we have been here for a long time, so... No, no. I I'm not talking about popularity here. Huh? What I'm trying to say is that you two are so loved that people always crave to see you in the screen. They crave it so much that they draw you over and over, wasting ink on all of you. But that's not my case. People don't want to see me. Parents don't want their children to see me. That's why I have this problem. Is it that bad? I'm surprised you can still smile despite all this. The only art there is of me, all of it, has me smiling. I can't express anything else but this. Oh boy. That, that sort of explains, explains it. it. I'm sorry to hear that. You sure had it rough. Yeah, not much could be done about it. Sorry again. I'll be on my way now. Wait! Uh, actually... How about you come with us before you leave? Huh? Well, I admit that we can't do much about your problem, but I'm sure there's something else we can do about your ink problem. I'm with Mick here. We can't leave you like that. You want to help me? Of course. Disneyland's all about making others happy. In fact, this is the place where dreams come true. Do they? We work to achieve that. So, what do you say? Dreams come, come true. true. Thank, Thank you. you. I'm sure we can find something in Dad's office. And if we don't, I'm sure we can just ask him. See, Ben? I'm sure we'll find a solution. I hope so. Ah, by the way, my name's actually Bendy. Huh, that's a good name. Bendy what? Just Bendy. Bendy. you're in here. Come out and show yourself. Please be human. Please be human. Please be human. It's not human. It's not human. Go away! Otherwise you go in. Wait. Wait. Wait.
It's made out of cardboard. Please don't cry. You threw an axe at Boris. 